here at the Dairy Adventure. My job is to answer questions from the audience, to monitor the deliveries that are happening here. If they need assistance, then I'm here to do that, and also to feed the calves after, after they're born. Probably the Dirty Jobs ep episode was uh, the most fun thing that I've had here. Um, never had a chance to be on television before, so it was my debut and probably won't happen too many times, but I also got asked to be on Secret Lives of Women, and they did an episode here of that with four different women that were doing different jobs than most women would do. So those are the things that I'm going to take with me for the rest of my life. Well, actually, my first calf delivery was when I was about 14 years old. I'm, I'm, my dad worked for a farmer, and he had asked me to go out and help him. And um, the, the, it was a beef operation, and the heifer was struggling. So my dad had me um, handing him all the different things that he needed to uh, help with the delivery, the lubrication and getting the chains ready and that type of thing. And we ended up having a live birth, so that was a great thing, because sometimes on the beef farm, we don't find out about it till the calf is already gone. So um, it was a good experience there. At the dairy itself, um, the most memorable are the ones that are kind of unique. Uh, maybe things are not going really the way you would like them to go. Maybe you've only got one leg or you got maybe the tail coming out first. So those in those situations, you have to learn how to reposition the calf then to get it out. So those are some interesting things that I do. It is a lot of fun uh, delivering babies. Um, I can't imagine myself in a desk job in an office somewhere just talking to people or whatever. I get to be out here experiencing people and also um, helping the moms with their deliveries and the babies. Um, there are some good things and bad things that go with everything. So sometimes we have some complications and a lot of times we have easy deliveries and I don't have to do a lot. Sometimes I have to help pull and sometimes people get to watch me do some hard things in the window. but. Um, I have a lot of patience and that's what helps me with uh, delivering babies and I'm sure that's the same thing with uh, babies in our world besides just baby calves. Uh, but you got to have some patience with the moms because they're in there not knowing what's going on. They're in a strange place. They got a lot of people watching them. So it's a little bit more of a, um, a little bit more challenging here because you have the audience and if things don't go right then there's no, no way to hide it. It's going to happen here. Okay, actually we're having the raffle um, here for a person to help deliver website. a calf. Of Is course I'm going to be there to help with here? the delivery also. So if there's any it problems or to let them know how, th how to do things and what they and need to be watching for. And um, so my advice to a person that wants to do this, I think it's a fun thing to do. Um, it can be a, a, a little bit maybe for a younger child or someone that's doing it. It's a little bit gross sticking your hand inside of a cow sometimes. I mean, not to me, but they might think it's a little gross. But um, actually, it's a very cool thing to see so, that live cat coming out.